What's up, everybody? Welcome to Single Ah, we're all so good. We get into some lore. We get into some lore heavy mess. Oh, is that the old man? Whoops. <laughs> well, I do. Pick it up. Drop it. Pick it up. Drop it. Up. They're gonna wake up and be friends. I'm so ready to find out more about these gels. What's up, everybody? And uh, we are we are back. We're back with some more stuff. It's been a while. I've been off. I've been confused and lost and lonely and sad and and depressed and gone and in another place, in another mind, in another way. But we're back! <laughs> uh, yes! <laughs> we got candy! This is taking longer. This is taking longer than I thought. This is a much, much longer process than I had anticipated. That took like a solid, like a solid uh, minute. Anyway, people, we are back with some more great content coming at you from single player. Like I told you guys in the video a couple weeks ago, uh, things are going to be changing a lot. I got a lot of fun ideas, new stuff coming up that uh, has not been done before. And I am just excited. And I hope that you guys are excited as well for what the future holds. My mouth is super saliva -y now that I've had candy. Anyway, today we're going to be playing a indie game, a new game, a fan game, if you will, uh, called Chow Resort Island. I saw it. It was posted on Kotaku today, and so I'm, I'm trying to get this done as quickly as I can because I know that a lot of people are probably going to run to this game, and I think it's really, really cool. And so I wanted to show you guys this game and show you what I think because I happen to be a huge, a huge Sonic fan, like a big old Sonic fan. Always have been, always will be, no matter what. And, you know, people talk a lot of, a lot of, a lot of mess. A lot of bad mess about the Sonic games, especially the 3D games. I don't. I personally, they're my favorite games in GameCube. Whenever they were on the GameCube, Sonic Adventure 2 Battle, and uh, Sonic Adventure, and the DX, and uh, God, were all so good. They were all so good to me. Even though people hate them, uh, I have such a special place in my heart for all of them, and I will play them a million times no matter what you tell me. What was really cool about uh, the director's cut and about Sonic Adventure 2 Battle is that in the game, they actually had a part where you would collect these little test tubes, uh, and you would collect these little animals, and then you had a place called the Chow Garden, and you would go back to the Chow Garden, and you would be able to take care of the chows. You'd be able to prepare them for races and get them ready for the day. Uh, and it was just a really unique part of the game that you were able to raise them. Uh, similar to a Tamagotchi, only, you know, real and in front of you and, and like these little chows. And so first thing that I want to go ahead and say is chow is the way you pronounce it. Chow. 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 Okay. That's the pronunciation that you'll be hearing in this video. If you can't handle that, if you're going to be pronouncing it KO or whatever, you're not, this is not for you. I know that it, it should be KO. That makes way more sense. Because for those of you that aren't aware, this is, a, this is a really getting into it here. We're getting into some lore. Getting into some lore heavy mess. In Sonic Director's Cut, Sonic DX, whatever you want to call it, uh, there was a character called Chaos. And it kind of came along at the same time. These Chows, which is short for Chaos. It's Chaos without the S. Chow, K-O. It makes more sense for Chaos because it's got that hard K-C-H sound to be K-O. Whatever. Chow sounds better. It's canon. Let's just get into it. I'm sweating. All right. Nefault First Presents. That's the creator of this game. That's the independent guy that's gotten into it. I'm going to tag him down in the bottom of this video. But all right. Nefault First's Chow uh, Resort Island. Here we go. I've got the controls down here below. Oh, oh, nice. Oh, what a sweet little panorama. This is uh, good, good on you not making just a standstill selection video. I mean, this reminds me of like a real, a real game. Cool. All right. Let's get started on this thing. Here we go. Um, I, I don't want it. I just want to play. I just want to get right on into it because I don't know anything. I don't know anything that I need to know yet. All right, welcome. It's summer and it's day and there's Sonic. Hey, you there. Wait just a second. Oh, is that the old man? Whoops. <laughs> Ooh, it's not easy for this fellow to travel back and forth through this area. Anyway, yeah, hi. Welcome to the island. 
Child Resort Island, that is. <laughs> you don't look familiar to me, so you must be a new guest. Well, let me introduce myself. I'm Professor Bunga, yeah. I own this here island and host these spots myself. We're in my courtyard. I'd appreciate it if you didn't pick the flowers, yeah. Tenants typically reserve space at these resorts to raise their child. Hmm. You know, the little blue creatures? I usually offer tips to raising them free of charge. You'll understand soon. Come. He is a chow. Okay. Right now, there's only one resort that has the open spot available. But you're in luck, son. It's perfect for beginners like you. To the left of us is the beach resort. Great place. Fine place. I think you'll like it. Go check it out and tell me what you think. I'd follow you there, but I need time to rest after running through here all day. <laughs> we'll discuss things further when you come back. All right. Cool. Let's do this thing. To the beach resort we go. Sanic. Okay, let's see. We got... Pick some weeds. Can I pick these weeds? No. Oh, there's a little egg. Is this a chow? Huh? This is an egg. I should probably leave it be. Put another egg. Oh, I do. This water looks pretty doggone good. Do I need to check out this egg too or something? Huh. Don't worry, buddy. Don't worry, buddy. If you've ever played Sonic Adventure 2 Battle or DX, then you know exactly what I'm talking about. Don't worry, buddy. All right, pick. Yeah. Pick it up. Drop it. Pick it up. Drop it. Pick it up. Okay. I really don't know what to do quite yet. Let's see what we got. Okay, we got two no-named chows. Can I name them? No. I guess they have to hatch first, huh? What should I do, though? Can I pick these flowers? Hey, Gramps, I don't know what to do. Oh. Gramps, I'm, I'm, I'm confused, Gramps. Oh, hey -o. that was pretty quick. So what you think? Relaxing sounds of the ocean waves, great view of the night sky, my personal favorite vacation spot. <laughs> yeah. The two eggs you saw on there are for guests who haven't brought in a child. Wow, you're in luck again. Be sure to take good care of them when they hatch. There are plenty of ways of doing so. Feeding them, petting them. We also offer great resources at the Results Center. You'll be able to buy fruit, toys, and more. So long as you have child tokens, yeah. Child tokens will allow you to buy anything. We don't take rings here. <laughs> you can earn these by entering your child in the child games. Fun stuff. Yeah, your child can compete with other child here in a number of fun activities we host. We can find out more about that at the Resort Center. Now, let's see. Oh, the resorts led from the other paths here are booked, so you'll only be able to use the beach resort <laughs> uh, for now. Look, we'll discuss that later. Just focus on the left path, okay? So now that's the end of that. I'll be in my office. Later from now, you might find me standing out here. Don't be afraid to have a chat. Well, see you around. Can I go in here? Oh, okay, fine, 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 fine. Back to the beach. Have my chows hatched yet? <gasps> my baby chows, please tell me you've hatched. No. Come on, come on, come on. I'm impatient. Come on. I'm just picking them up and putting them. Down. I'm gonna put them right next to each other. Come, 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 come. Be friends. They're gonna wake up and be friends immediately. So now what do I do? I don't know how to get chow tokens because I haven't I haven't got any chows yet. And this old man here is just here and. Can't go down here, can I? No. The resort center. Let's see what we got going on. Oh, yeah. Gift shop. Oh, I love that sound effect. Okay, wow. That's a lot of stats. That's a lot of stats to look into. Can I do I don't have any items to sell. I love the sound effects. They feel so good. I don't have any, I don't have any chow yet. But I'm excited to get them. I'm like, I'm so ready. I'm so ready to find out more about these chows. You might catch me out here from time to time. I enjoy the scenery. If you need advice, don't hesitate. Come talk to me. I did. You were unhelpful. Please tell me they've hatched. I'm ready to start raising some chow, yo. Come on. Okay, I see him doing a little shimmy. Did you see him doing a little shimmy shake? I did. I saw a little shimmy shake. Don't worry, buddy. All right, well, I guess we're going to wait. We're going to wait for them. We're gonna wait for them to hatch. Might take a little bit of time. I could probably eat some now and laters.
It's happening. It's happening. I got a chow and I've got food in my mouth. All right. Firstborn chow. Oh, and food's falling. Whenever you pick up your chow, their stats will appear. These stats will show your current, your chow's current state, as well as their progress. <sighs> Give your chow items like fruit to raise its hunger bar and other stats. Notice uh, the actions prompt on the top right corner of the screen. This prompt will appear whenever you interact with chow items and other things. Press the D key to toggle through options while this prompt appears. Happy chow raising! Yay! He's happy! Pet him. <laughs> Don't worry, buddy. Don't worry, buddy. All right. Let's get him some food. Can I give? Give. Eat that, okay? Oh, yeah! Look at him go! <laughs> Don't worry, buddy. Oh, he said it! Don't worry, buddy! <laughs>